Today we'll talk about the century-long discussion ever since Sir Isaac Newton asked water, are you wet because you're water or are you water because you're wet? Some people will argue that water is wet because if water gets thrown at you, you get wet. However, some will argue that since wetness is a property, then water cannot be that property. However, I'm throwing my hat into the ring to say that they're both wrong because water is a paradox. A paradox is described as a situation, person, or thing that combines contradictory features and or qualities. For example, if water isn't wet because it can't be its own property, then if I had two cups, cup A and cup B, and they're both filled with water, since cup A and cup B are different entities, if I pour cup B into cup A, does that mean that cup A contains wet water. Think about it, if wetness is a property that water gives off, then cup A must contain wet water by that logic. Now think about what I just said on a global scale. The water cycle is just the cup example I just talked about. When water evaporates in the clouds, it becomes a different entity. And then when that cloud eventually rains into a body of water, that means two different entities are colliding, meaning that body of water is should be containing wet water. Water is constantly mixing with itself, thus creating a paradox, where any body of water is both wet and unwet at the same time. Thus ending the age old question, is water wet? No, water is a paradox. Hey yo, you forgetting something man. What could I possibly be forgetting? Lava you dumb bitch. Oh yeah, um, okay, let's talk about lava real quick. So when people bring up this conversation of is water wet, the people who don't believe water is wet would also bring up this question, is lava wet too? Anyone who's watched Vsauce would know that lava isn't water, but water is lava. Hey yo, what type of bullshit are you spitting? Let me cook, god damn it. Give me a second. You see, in Vsauce's video, there's lava inside you, he explains that ice is technically a mineral, therefore a rock. If water is just melted ice, aka a liquid form of a rock, it is considered a form of lava. Therefore, lava, just like water, is also paradoxical, where it is both wet and unwet at the same time. Let's talk about that word, wet, because as humans, we associate being wet to a cool liquid hitting our bodies instead of a hot liquid hitting our bodies, when technically speaking, it is the same thing. If I took boiling water and threw it on you, you would get wet, even if it's scolding hot. So pretty much, if I could take lava and pour it on you, yes, you would burn to death, but you're still getting wet. Now, does that clear everything we should talk about when it comes to this topic? I still think you a little bitch. Also, if you took anything in this video seriously, I, I just have no words for you. It's just a joke, man. Calm down.